Torque Mada nació en Valladolid en 1420. Su la misión era liberar a España de todo la herrería. Torque Mada dijo a Isabella que debe casarse con Rey Ferdinand. Torque Mada era el gran inquisidor de 1408 y 3 y 1498. Torque Mada quería proteger la única fe verdada, la Iglesia Católica. La gente llamaba a los judíos convertidos conversos. Tomás de Torquemada quería que los judíos convertieran a catolicismo. Torquemada se sentía que los judíos no respetaban a Jesucristo. La palabra Torquemada quería decir la crueldad despiadada. Torque Mata se miria de natural causa en 1498 a la edad de 78. Torque Mata entered into the local monastery at a very young age and was eventually promoted to the prior. He was Isabella I's closest supporter and ally. Torque Mata came from a very rich family, but he enjoyed humbling himself. He advised Queen Isabella I of Castile to marry King Ferdinand of Aragon. He wanted to be able to consolidate their kingdoms and form a power base that he could use whenever he needed. The Catholic people were urged to spy on their neighbors to see if anyone was defying the Catholic Church. Torque Mata and King Ferdinand had Jewish roots. Torque Mata was only allowed to target the secret Jews, a Jew that practiced openly was spared. Some researchers say that he is responsible for killing 2,000 Jews or more, but others say that he is responsible for maybe half of that and at most 1,500. The Jews that were condemned to death were forced to wear a black San Benito, which is a design of flames, dragons, demons, and snakes to signify that hell was waiting. Torque Mata might have had a lot in common with Hitler, but he didn't kill the Jews seeking power. He was motivated by religious action and th thought that he was serving the Lord. But even though he was not like Hitler in the way of wanting power, his persecution of the Jews in Spain bears a similarity to Hitler's persecution of the Jews in Europe. Just as Hitler wanted a superior Aryan race, Torque Mata thought pure blood Catholic and Spanish blood was superior. Both men made the Jews wear identification markers on their outer clothing. Torque Mata grew very paranoid in his late years and kept a unicorn's horn next to his plate to ward off poisons in his food. After he died, the Spanish Inquisition continued for 336 more years. After he died, Jews were still being killed and at the end of the Inquisition, around 30,000 Jews were murdered. Although he did not directly start the Inquisition, it was during his time that torture and death was a normal activity. The Spanish chronicler Sebastian de Olmedo called him the hammer of heretics, the light of Spain, the savior of his country, the honor of his order. In 1832, his tomb was broken into, and his bones were stolen and incinerated as though an act of faith had taken place. <laughs>